Everybody, it's Tyler with First Updates Now. We're here at the Houston Championship with the number one ranked team in the FRC Top 25. 13 23, an absolutely phenomenal season here uh, so far. So I'm here with Victor, John, and Roger. We're going to learn a little bit more about this absolutely incredible robot um, behind the bumpers. So uh, I want to start out uh, talking about uh, your guys' uh, uh, your climb, your elevator, your drive. We have a lot of cool things. So uh, what do you want to start talking about on the spot? Um, um, so something I want to mention is kind of our unique climb. Um, so we kind of have a two-in-one system. So um, these are our jacks right here all on the robot. So the way our climb works is we line up flat against the hab on level three um, with our ball intake on the back over here. This comes down. And this works kind of like a two-in-one. So not only is this, is this how we pick up balls, but it's also, also how we climb. So this lifts our front part of our robot up. And then with the jacks, we lift the bottom part of the robot up. And we just roll onto uh, level three. So looking really good with that. Obviously, it's been very effective uh, for you this season as well. So let's continue this uh, hype train here going on. Uh, John, what do you want to talk about in your bot today? Uh, we can talk about the elevator over here. Uh, this one has like, a pretty interesting story. So last year in Einstein, we were pretty happy to get there, but our last match, which was like against 1619 Citrus, our partners actually ripped out our elevator rigging. So this year we tried out this really cool design where we would rig, we would run all the elevator internals riggings through the tubings. And we would all go through this loop, which would come back to the coil or drum back, back to the bottom of the elevator. So, yeah. So sorry right here. If you notice, we have all these going Going up to the top here, which will tension through some simple ratchets. And then they'll loop over the top of the carriage down to these two drums under this little integer here, which will tension as well. And what's so great about it is because it keeps all the rigging out of everybody's way, so we never really have to worry about anything becoming loose or, loose or tight because of the ratchets and the internal rigging. So. Let's wrap up here talking about uh, something I think has been very distinctive for you guys this year. Of course, is your amazing sword drive. You guys have been able to elude all sorts of defense during the competition season. Uh, so let's talk a little bit about sword, Victor. I know you got a sword module in your hand. Love to hear about that. Uh, yeah. Okay, so uh, we have four sword modules on the bot, one on each corner. And uh, basically, it's like pretty similar to last year. It's just like more compact. So you can take a closer look at it here. Uh, the Minasim powers the drive, and we actually have a seven side pro motor here that powers the actual steering of the wheel and everything here is like custom machined and um, yeah it's pretty hard to um, play defense against us because we can rotate and translate at the same time so yeah it's pretty unique. An absolutely incredible machine by 1323 this year. Uh, gentlemen can't wait to see more of your robot here at championships. Good luck uh, during this uh, Houston championship. Can't wait to see what you do. Thank you.